three things I'd like you to take away from today. Firstly, optimism is genetic, contextual, and extremely captured. We can catch optimism. We can also catch pessimism. They're contagious, very contagious. Humans are naturally optimistic, about 40% of all our genetics, in terms of optimism, um, predisposes us to be optimistic. When we're born, we're incredibly optimistic. Incredibly optimistic. I mean, to a, to a very small child, um, they're watching a film, and when someone loses a limb in that film, they expect the, the limb to grow back. You know, I can remember talking to a four-year-old once, and the four-year-old's grandmother had just died. And the parents were trying to explain to this four-year-old that grandma had died. The four-year-old listened very intensely, registered all the right emotions, and then when the parents thought that the child had really got it, the child said, but we'll be going to see her on at the weekend as usual, won't we? They didn't get the idea, you know, that, that there was an end. Incredibly optimistic. The other thing about optimism is that stress kills it. Now, we live in extremely stressful times. In fact, one of the... <laughs> one of the interesting things, I thought I'd come over and talk to you guys. Can I shake your hand? To Val. To Val. I thought I was neglecting you guys over here. I thought I'd come over. You feel like it, do you? People don't come over here very often, do they? I mean, <laughs> and yet, this is just as good over here, you know. Um, 